energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the way in yesterday. It's cut my hair. Well, not. I just cut it. Ten rounds slated in the books tonight. Here's the first. Good counter punch by Nichols. I love the way he delivered that, Teddy. Yeah, he's using his feet to set up his offense. You don't only see that, but you see it there. A piercing hook to the head by Kobe Nichols. Wow, so he only throw, you only know how to throw hooks, right? That's a nice right hand that time by Nichols. Nichols is putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. He missed with that headshot. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. Big puncher here in front of us, going up against the guy who can do a little bit of everything. A boxer, puncher, well-skilled, good athlete, well-conditioned. And yeah, the big punch, I think, is going to be in trouble, especially as the fight goes late. He's going to get more and more desperate, and he's going to look for that one bomb. And usually when you know it's coming, you can avoid it. To the Good job, so you kept me well up top. Making your shit up. You over punching, bro. Good return fire that time. Good smooth work by Nichols. That's classic counter punching. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder. He kid me with right that right little jab shit right. he's doing. Just punching air that time. His opponent was able to get out Nick of the way. Nick will be bringing that uppercut from the ground. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Yeah. Final 10 seconds of round number one. <clears throat> we come to the end of the round. Joe and Teddy. I got hit a lot. Teddy, that's one of those rounds where I wonder what was hitting me that time, though. Because it's tough to kind of draw a line on those two fighters. Yeah, very close, but one of those So did I hit you or you countered my hit with a hit? A little bit more in those last 30, 20 seconds. Maybe that's the impression right, the judges are left with. Oh, hands up, hands up. Got it. Strategy, y'all. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Nichols' defense. Is it ever going to be able to block those punches? Well, you can tell he's being patient, waiting for a countering opportunity. Teddy, what does he have to think about playing that trap? All he has to do is think a little bit like I do a tax season with my accountant. <laughs> I don't want to go into that office. You know, my accountant's standing at the door. He's waiting for me to come in there. I don't want, I want a rebate. And that's what he wants. He wants a rebate. He wants a counter. He's stepping back and he's waiting for the guy to come to him. So he's the one who gets his way. Good effective work with that straight right hand. Nichols' combination punching working out well there. He landed three solid shots. A solid true uppercut by Kobe Nichols. Damn, what, what was that? A hook? That was quick as hell. I was trying to sleep with, with a left. Nichols is jacked by an uppercut. Up top with a quick hook. Good solid shots with the combo downstairs. He hit me though. His punch is so random. They random now. So harder to dodge all of them. Earlier it was easy though. Throwing that jab out there. I was just blocking that shit. Ooh. Okay, so he love that uppercut. I'ma fuck you over. Hit me with that uppercut one more time. I'm going to sleep. Not me. Yeah, I am going to go to sleep. I damn near should have went down at least twice in that motherfucker. I ain't going to lie. Because I ain't blocking at all right now. Believe it or not, this is Boxing 101. This is basic movements, basic fundamentals. Some guys have not been taught the defensive skills. Practicing blocking. Good, solid right hand lands. That's a razor sharp uppercut by Kobe Nichols. Did you see that? You know, when you bully the bully, you 
you can do that right there. Tyson floored by the power. Hit him with the fucking uh peekaboo. <laughs> Peekaboo for the for the hook. Okay. Oh, now he going to my body. You going crazy, Mike? You showing out? Chill. Chill out. Yeah, now I'm stalking. Since you want to go to my body. You want to go to my body? Well I'm going to go to yours. Zones in on that overhand right. What an excellent two punch combo. Yeah, you guys feel time with them, Dad. Nichols' movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. Oh, that's got to hurt. Now I want to hit you again. Down again. The question is. Continue on. Hitting them with them lasers, man. Hitting them with beams, special beam cannons, man. From right hand side. Was Piccolo left handy? Yeah, he was left handed. I, I did it from the right hand side, though. Nichols' right hand working well that time. He scored well. Well, you could see what he wanted to do there, but unable to land that body shot. I'm bleeding? Oh hell no. You got me leaking. Beautiful. That was that was fucking amazing. I want another round like that. This is your fight, okay? You're in complete control. Of course this is my fight, I'm the king. Well things continue like this, this is gonna be an interesting stretch run of this fight. Beginning of Come round on. number Come four. On, Mike. Tyson's in really what appears to be a dead even fight on your scorecard, Teddy. Yeah, it is. And to separate it, if they're going to separate themselves as the night goes on. It's going to come down to the inside. Whoever decides not to make those little silent agreements, you know, you hold me, I won't punch. I hold you, you won't punch. Whoever decides to bring their hands back and do some work on the inner quarters. Nichols' cut is really a mess right now, and it could jeopardize this fight for him right here. Teddy, is there blame that needs to be placed on his cut man? Could he have done more? Well, really, the trick to being a cut man is pretty simple. It's not rocket science. You have to have the right medicine, the right coagulants. You have to be calm. You have to be able to put pressure on that cut, get it to stop, and then put those medicines in. But you need a little help from your fighter. You need him to move a little bit on his bike and give those medicines time to work. He scored well after being hit himself. Right hand downstairs. Punches and bunches, combination up top. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. I'm tired. My guess. So. Eddie, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here tonight? Why well, his hand just stop right there? Oh no! Actually, I would say a little counterpunching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for him. Let me chill for my get up one off on me. Mike Tyson with a big uppercut. And that does it for this round. <clears throat> now that we're back in the corner, we get a close up look. Nichols is cut even with the worst. No, it don't, bro. It just went down by 10%. Good playing. See, that'd be lying, bro. Hey, I ain't noticed until now. Must be steady. The, the judges be lying like a motherfucker. Well, the commentators be lying. He said we got this as a dead even fight right now. You fucking lie. He probably got that round though. That was because I was just bullshit. I'm trying new combos. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. Nichols is oh. 
Damn. Lift his ass off the ground. His feet wasn't even on the ground when I hit him with that motherfucker. Damn. I ain't gonna lie. That was vicious, though. I damn near knocked his head off his shit. With the uppercut. You can get up. Take your time, man. GG, bro. You fought hard that time. He's still throwing too many punches, though, bro. The ref stops the fight. Nichols' bombs away worked again.